It's me, Mikey fucking Pipes. Welcome to episode three of Mikey Pipes Uncensored. Right now we're at the Highlands, which is in Aspen, Colorado. We're leaving here today and we're heading over to Lake Tahoe. I just wanted to give a moment of silence to all the Ukrainians out there. It's fucking nuts what Putin's doing. And let me tell you this, if fucking Donald Trump was president right now, Putin wouldn't have the fucking balls. But we got fucking Sleepy Joe in office. Doesn't know what the fuck is. Doesn't even, I'm surprised they let him out of the basement more than once a week. Jesus F in Christ. Oh, I did it again. Oh, I'm sorry. The whole Jesus Christ thing. I'm sorry, guys. And another thing, leaving politics aside, but I think it you know, kind of relates to that. Why the fuck did they remove, like, shop from, like, middle school and high school, right? When I was in high school, they had auto mechanic class. We had shop. We had architecture. We had all this crazy stuff. But now... Now, in school, they want, they want to push the youth to go to college. And if you're not fortunate enough to have either a scholarship or rich parents, you know, or parents who could pay that for you, then you're going to go to college and you're going to be saddled with debt. Let me tell you something. In four years, if you were in the trades, not only will you have no fucking debt, but you're going to make some good effing money. So if you're a younger generation, I know this is the uncensored channel and what have you, but if you're a late, you know, late teens, 15, 16, whatever, listen, if, if you're mechanically inclined, think about it. Think about it. Maybe just intern for like a week or two, you know, with an electrician or a plumber, an HVAC company. Think about it. Really, really think about it. Oh my God, guys, you got to see this view. Oh, look at this. Hold on. Look at this. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful. It's beautiful, seriously. Let me lift up the lift. Seriously consider the trades. Just try it out. Because you never know. You never know. You might love it. You might love it. You might love it. And you'd have yourself not a job which is just over broke. You'll have yourself a career. Get out of my way. Get the fuck out of my way. And yes, one-handed Mike. One-handed Mike. We're going to the slip. Right there. Because we're going to go to the peak. I hope the, the noise, the wind noise isn't intolerable. Maybe I'll have to do some editing when I land. Let's see what this is. Oh, I can do that. Let's go. I gotta tell you, I love skiing. It's a lot of fun. But I haven't been skiing in two years, and let me tell you something, yesterday was brutal. Brutal. Okay. I need to go to this lift right there. I lost him. I definitely, let's see. Oh yeah, I definitely lost him. Don't 
think that I didn't vandalize. Don't think I didn't vandalize with stickers. There it is. There it is. All right, so it really pisses me off. You know, when I was in junior high school, we had home ec. And we learned to like do stupid things like so. We learned to like cook little things, bake, balance a checkbook, you know, stuff like that. And we also had shop class. And like three or twice, three, or twice or three times a week, you know, we built things. We built bridges out of fucking popsicle sticks. How many of you guys remember building bridges with fucking pipes, popsicle sticks? That's right. And it was a lot of fun. Should I drop in here, guys? Nope. Not gonna do it. Not gonna do it. Building bridges with popsicle sticks, gentlemen. That's what I did. Hey, crazy Mike Pipes, go fuck yourself. That's right. No, fuck you. All right, I'm gonna head down there. Yeah, let's head down there. Mikey fucking pipes, one-handed, one-handed. So let me get your thoughts and feedback down in the comment section down below. What's your feedback on the elimination of shop, home ec, and these like hands-on classes in school? They need to bring it back and they, we need to make America great again. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today is Tuesday, March 1st. Love you guys. Be well. God bless. Stay safe. And I forgot to say it. Fuck Navian. Fuck you, Navian.